Hey, what's up? John Sonmez from simpleprogrammer.com. And today I'm gonna to be doing a book review from a fellow YouTuber, Evan Carmichael. Uh, he wrote a book called Your One Word. You can check it out here. I listened to the audio version of the book. I believe he recorded it himself. He did a real good job on, on the recording of it. And it is a really interesting book. This book reminded me a lot of another book that I did a review on called the or start with why which which was is a very interesting very popular book but I did not really like that much I felt like it was it was very basic where Evan in, in his book in your one word really had the same concept of, of the why being really important but he went into so much more details and gave so many more examples and so much more information in the book so I, I thought it was actually really really good how he did that so the book is essentially about this idea that and Evan Carmichael basically he has one word that he used to sort of define his business that's his why really which is belief okay and so he basically advocates picking one particular word for your business and just like like I said in start with why where where uh, the the author of, of that book advocates basically you know that the, the why is important that it's it's not the the features or the benefits Evan calls it the core and and it's essentially the, the key component is is why you're doing something what are you about and he says you should be able to boil that down to one word and that one word sort of informs all the other things that you decide in your business and how you market and brand yourself and, it, and it's what people get behind and he uses some really good examples I think of some some different companies that have the one word I was trying to think of for a simple programmer what my one word is I've got a few ideas there but I, I haven't quite come up with it I'm not sure if I'm gonna commit to that or if I'm, I might actually do two words but I'm thinking about this I think this is an interesting concept or just even just going through the exercise of thinking about what is your one word makes you really think about what it's not right and that's one of the ways that he talks about in the book about figuring out what your one word is is figure out what are you not about what are you against and it really makes a lot of sense I think you know it, it's one of those things that I've sort of come to learn as I've been been growing simple programmer you know when I first started out with simple programmer I had an idea right and I wrote blog posts and I sort of had this concept and I was really thinking in terms of what kind of product that I was going to create or, or what kind of articles that I was going to produce and I wasn't really thinking about the bigger why or, or, or what is the, the value, what is the, the, the thing that we're trying to accomplish here and I sort of made that shift right? I think about probably about a, a year and a half or two years ago as I was doing some deep soul searching myself and I started to really understand the value of polarizing though and it started to really say you know, look it, it's not about, we're, we're not about simply you know, figuring out how to do something technical or even just just soft skills in general we're not just about that we're about like this mission right and I and I discovered I said okay well what am I about what am, what is my mission and I realized that the reason why or the primary thing and it's become very apparent as as I've talked with some mastermind groups business mastermind groups and they've basically said it's obvious John but it's become very apparent to me that one of the things that's going to be one of the key components that makes Simple Programmer successful is is going to be me. It's going to be what I'm bringing to it, my mission, my personal statement. And so I can't I can't back away from that. I can't step away from that. I can't. Simple Programmer doesn't really exist, at least the way that it's structured right now, without me. And so I think this book is is really interesting because it it really it really boils that down. I think a lot of people read a book like uh, E Myth Revisited, which is an excellent book, very, very good book, and they try to figure out how to pull themselves out of the business. And that's what I was trying to do a lot with Simple Programmer. But lately, like I said, in the past few months, I've been realizing no, no, <laughs> that's, you, you don't want to do that. I mean, to some degree, maybe you could remove yourself from a business, but you, your heart has to be there. Your mission, right? That's what people are going to line against because. You know, people don't just have loyalty to a product. They have loyalty to a brand, but it's not just a brand. It's what the brand represents. And, and I think that's the key, again, looking at, like I said, the, the Start With Why book, but I feel like Evan Carmichael just hit it much better with, with, with his book here where, where he talks about that one word because that, that really simplifies the idea and he goes into a lot of, a lot of details of, of how that works and what, you, what your one word should be and how, you, how should, you should utilize that word. But it's become very much 
very clear to me that that his approach, that this idea of having a business, having whatever cause that you're after, to to, to be rallied behind even even just one word, where, where it represents, it represents you, it represents your heart, it represents what you're about, and people who align with that, right? A lot of you that subscribe to this channel, you align with that mission for what I'm about, what Simple Programmer is about, and and that's why you're a customer. That's why you're a subscriber. That's why you you want to consume the content because you, we're on that same mission. So that's really the thing is you know I could produce a lot of content, produce a lot of stuff, and and it, it doesn't matter if it's not aligned behind that mission. If there's not some rallying point where you're like, yes, this is what I want. This is what I'm psyched up about. And that's and as I think about it as a consumer, those are the things. You know, there's certain brands, there's certain companies that I'm going to buy what they what they're selling because I, I love what they're about I love their message I love the feel of that and that's it, it's such a critical point and I, you know I think there's more and more people sort of discovering this today in the entrepreneurship world but Evan Carmichael really I think he puts it very very well in this book and, and he's a good example with his believe his hashtag believe that he uses you know some people will laugh and say oh well that's that's kind of funny but you know it, it really did work it really did change his business and it gives him a focus and I, I feel like the book is is a really good book for that. So if you are an entrepreneur, if you're starting a business, if you're thinking about starting a business, this is a, a book that I would definitely recommend because it's going to give you that that thought, that conceptual thought of if I had to distill what I'm about and, and what I'm about is what my business is going to be about and I have to bring that personal touch and that heart to it, then what is that one word going to be? And if you, I think if you start with that framework in mind, you're going to have a lot more success. You know, one of the things that I'm always about on the entrepreneurship road is, is audience building, is building an audience and, and getting people to, to fall behind you, not just to have the, the best product or, or the best offering, but to actually get people that are aligned with your mission. And, and so I think Evan and I probably agree very much on a lot of the ways that we approach business. And, it, and I think it's, it's, it's a way to stand out today. I mean, there's so many SaaS applications and businesses and YouTube channels and information out there that it's, it's not a lack of information. What it is, is it's a lack of heart. And there's, there's a lot of people out there that are selling stuff and they have companies and the company is, is an empty shell, it has no heart. So that's all I gotta say about that. I think it's a good book, definitely check it out. It's called Your One Word. Uh, by Evan Carmichael, again, fellow YouTuber. You can, I'll, I'll give a little link to his channel here, his YouTube channel. He's got some great videos. He did a lot of like top 10 videos. I've been, I've, I've watched a lot of his videos where he takes a lot of the powerhouses in the industry and he conveys their, their top 10 things. Uh, he's done a lot of really good videos like that. So if you want to get more videos from me, <laughs> go ahead and click that subscribe button below. Just click it right there and uh, you'll get all my book reviews. I do about two to three, probably a week. And I do about two to three videos a day here at Simple Programmer. All right, I'll talk to you next time. Take care.